Santa's Grotto, and do you know who I am? I am Father Christmas. Santa, that's in his grotto, that's Santa, that's me. It's that time of year, isn't it, when Mum and Dad take three weeks off work to get everything nice and special and give the little nippers the time of their lives. Yeah, and also they get pissed out of their minds and stuff their own goals. And why not? That's what I say. I'm pitching it, Revy. You, know, you get on with it, darling. We're in a... Oh, goodness. Look at the size of... Oh, that a lovely turkey. That... What, did you get that in there? Yeah. Fantastic. That's a great supermarket, isn't it? Marvellous. I've mean, got just about everything. Absolutely everything in there. Really? Yes, yeah, fantastic. Have you got your booze yet or not? Because I've got a... Well... Oh, well, you should see the liquor department in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you've got, you've got all the family coming over for oh, Christmas, all that sort of, yeah, lovely that, isn't it? Yeah. I'll tell you what, Tony, look, leave this to me. I'll, uh, I'll load all this up for you, all right? There you nice go. Of you. I'll charge you legend out, is it? Well, I'm recording it for posterity, aren't oh. I? Your grandchildren will be pleased to see oh, this. I don't know grandchildren, I'll have a bloody heard of you, that's what I'll have. You took your time, didn't you? Oh, I'm, I'm doing all the hard work, you've only got a turkey. Oh, I've got food, yeah? Oh, dear, you love it. <laughs> and so Christmas gets off with a bang as the Christmas nosh makes its way over the drawbridge and into our castle of Christmas. Thank you. Look, you have to get this over the bottom. Well, help me then. We're trying to get too much in, aren't you? You're trying to get. Hold on a minute. Fire! The binary! It's, it's in there. What are you talking about? Darth Vader. Oh, he does panic, doesn't he? Damn old work it is looking after the kids all your life. Look at that. I was saving that, wasn't I? <laughs> Hello, are you Santa's little helper? Come to help out Santa in his grotto. Yeah, I am. Well, sit down and play the ruddy music then. Alright, well, I suppose it'll play that. Stay up, she's supposed to go there. X marks the spot. An X mass is what it's all about. As long as I can remember, it's been a tradition in our household to mark the festive season with a pagan symbol, to wit, a circle of plastic holly and a couple of pine cones banged up on the castle door with me hammer. Incidentally, that hammer holds a special place in my affections since it was a gift from a darling wife the previous Yule Tide. Oh! What, what have you done to my door? Right, Andy Man, you are. Look at the mess you oh. have. So, welcome to our Christmas. So, welcome to our Christmas home. Thank 
How we done the decorations? And that's magic! No, no, but seriously, how we really done the decorations? <laughs> This is happy, happy Christmas. Yeah. All right. And that's from Carol and Fred at the pub. At the pub. The pub. At the pub. Yeah. That's right. See it there. Yeah. Oh look, it's a nice one. Got a stocking on the front. <laughs> All right. Stop that. Concentrate. This one's from from Alan. Now where where do we know that? We've seen this word before. Come on. Right. P. R. B. Up. Very good. That's a good boy. Well, you turn that bloody thing off or I'll smash your head in. Oh, 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 again. Well, there we are. That's Christmas for you, full of all sorts of things. But have you noticed, girls and boys, there is one thing what is missing. Do you know... The Xmas tray... <laughs> All right, Peter. All right, Alan. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Very funny, though. Very good. Cool, cool, cool. Don't you take nothing seriously. Oh, he's enjoying himself. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, up. Right. Shut up. Shut up. Right. Here we go, team. No, oh, just a minute. Well, oh, no, don't. Oh, I'm going to chop my legs off. Stop. Oh, Oh, These days, most people get their Christmas tree the easy way, by going down a shop and buying one. But we and our mate Alan like to do it with a traditional method. Christmas wouldn't be Christmas without the annual nicking of the Christmas tree, as I think all nature lovers will agree.